What's up guys? Welcome to the video. Today we have a push day and chest day. Let's get to it. Let's go. By the way, it is also freezing out today. It is insanely freezing, but hey, my breath. But uh, if you guys love the content, make sure you hit that subscribe button and uh, yeah. So today I have some tips on how y'all can lose weight the fastest, not fastest, but the efficient way and a quick way, of course, the, or the quickest way and to show you guys the best workouts to do, of course, for a push day. But the best back warm-ups is the pull parts. Oh, man. I, feel, I wear the wrong pants today, by the way. Oh, these are the wrong one pants, but we the wrong ones today. Shoot. It's all good, though. We're the wrong ones, but hey, we're, out. we're gonna keep on. These look good, though. These look good. I feel like I overthink it sometimes. So I'm like, you know what, like, I, I wore the wrong ones, but then again, it's like, ugh. I, mean, I, I it's like, ugh. I, these are my old surgeons I've had since 2020. I've had these for almost four years. Like, get this, these are the Lululemon. I've, I've had these for almost four years. Ridiculous. Ridic Lululemon lasts for a long time. But recently, their shorts, I mean, okay. I get it, I made videos about their shorts, shorts before, but, they have not had anything new. Like it's just like they've been lacking it recently. All they had is the colors. So that's all they had. It's, that's newer is the colors. But guys, they need, they need new actual shorts. Like actual like new shorts. Like it can't, it can't be just releasing pace breakers all the time. By the way, pace breakers are the uh, the common Lululemon short that you probably see people wearing sometimes, but. I mean, yeah, my like, guys can't keep releasing shorts, man. It's like, this is not gonna, not shorts, but colors. This is not gonna work. It's not, it's just, it's not good. Whatever, anyways, we have an incline bench press. Let's go. We're gonna focus on going slow on the way down, pausing and pressing through. We got 15 reps of that though. And we're going to really try and get this going. All right, let's do it. Some Boston too. He's a pretty fun artist, by the way. But anyways, focus on going slow, controlled. Love it. Oh, a spot, a spot, a spot. Oh. Oh. I can't get back. <laughs> it. That's it. Oh. Oh. What happened there? Got 11, I was supposed to get 15 there. Nice. <laughs> Yeah, I'm used to like going a little bit. Get your butt out of my video, bro. <laughs> Anyways, <sighs> supposed to get a uh, 15 there, got 11. Going down a little bit now. Man, I would have loved have to have 15. The thing is, though, is I'm used to going a little bit faster than that, so it's gonna the weight's gonna be the weight's gonna for sure be affected 100%. So, man, I gotta put the sets in as, dang it, man. The reps are, the reps in as 11. And the weight is going to be, damn it. But, the good news is I was slower, so we're getting more squeeze now. So, it's just fine. We have a set of 10 now. Three sets, 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 three, sets, three sets of ten reps here. <laughs> so, <sighs> anyway, so today it's been cold the past few days. It's continuing to be cold, but okay. Elbows in. This 
Let's do it again. You got this, guys. This is easy money. Easy money. Easy money. 10 reps. That was better. That was better. Man. I'm more sure of that. I think a bench press is the best workout to progressively overload, which means going more weight each week. So you can easily track the weight. It's a pretty straightforward movement. You can, and honestly, you can have a spotter. A spotter, a spotter is a great tool for it. Even though I don't have one today, a spotter is a great tool for your lifts. If you don't have a spotter, you can ask anyone in the gym. This is, it's by, by the way, people think that, oh, if I ask for a spotter, He's just gonna say, no, I'm just gonna be embarrassed. No, it's an ego boost if, so, if you ask someone for a spot, it's like, oh yeah, I know what I'm doing. Let me go help someone else. It's not like, they're not gonna help you. So, key point there. All right guys, pump cover off. 10 reps here, we place each side. They have a drop set to do after this. You can go, let's do it. Okay, wait 30 seconds, we'll do a drop set. So we have 10, plate off, 10, plate off, 10, plate off. So it'll roughly be about 30 years of reps here. And uh, hey man, in about 30 seconds, I'm gonna go. Oh man, I'm pretty good right now. Once again, these pants are, they look, they look good, but I'm just like, it's, they're so old, man. Four, almost four years. I need to get another pair, by the way. I want another pair of the lemon drivers, dude. It's so nice. The well, space in my camera right now is hard to come by. My SD card is like full. So I was filming that last clip and my storage went out just as I was about to do the drop set. But it was a good drop set, it was good. By the way, I was, but I was saying that on a, on a machine workout, if you press and hold it for a second and squeeze, you come back and pull it here, you want to squeeze on those machine workouts because once again, well on any workout, but on a machine, especially because you're, it's a isolating workout, like even here on a cable machine, this is an isolation movement, so you want to isolate and squeeze that muscle that you're working. So that, 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 that's a big thing. So even here, I want to squeeze and hold it. I'm <laughs> So like, see how I squeezed each movement for a second? Which one I can track to get that mind muscle connection from my, to my chest. I come back, even focusing even when I'm here on my chest too. Two big things, two key steps that you can do to see more more progress in the gym. So, and but going heavier now. But same concept though here, same concept. Hold. 
Not too heavy here, by the way, as well. We can go heavy in the last set. All right, now we have a one arm tricep extension. We're gonna squeeze that tricep at the bottom. Uh, gotta keep my shoulders up. Uh, great for muscle balances. Oh, great for targeting that one side. Five, six, seven, eight, two more. One more. That's it. Woo, baby. Pumping up that tricep. I finished the workout. It was a solid workout. That was the push day. We went pretty heavy on bench press. And we went pretty heavy basically on everything besides the flies. I felt like I could, I could go on a little heavier on that but still a solid workout. Now we gotta go home and eat some food and meal prep, yeah, I work today at 1 p.m. So, and yes, it is just a Sunday. I do work on weekends too. Uh, on this and my other job too. But uh, yeah guys, that's what we got and uh, let's go home and get some food in us, some protein, some creatine, and some vitamins. Cause you know what man, November is ending and you know what that means man, colds, cold season's coming so we gotta take some zinc, some vitamin, uh, Vitamin D for the clouds, of course, because I'm. Dude, in Michigan, it's like it's cloudy so often, it's not even funny, and it has already started. So, and we also need to uh, take some vitamin C as well. Man, with those colds, man, they suck. So we do not want to get a cold this season. We want to prevent it as much as possible. So let's do that, and yeah, and and food. Let's do it. So one thing I love to do, by the way, is do a little bit. Of back and core maintenance so I just like to come here and do a plank and squeeze my butt and my abs as hard as I can 30 seconds this helps bring your pelvis neutral it's a lot of times when we sit a lot my pelvis can tilt one way or the other way and can tend to cause some lower back pain so just squeezing tight and holding and squeezing tight can really help bring our pelvis back to neutral here this is a great way by the way, the clip's a bit lower short because my camera has been uh, lacking space, so I've been having to clear out my camera in between videos as it runs out of space. Which is fine with me, but a lot of times it's been like, F me, why can't, I, why can't I just clear out my SD card when I had a chance? All good. We F up sometimes. Not the end of the world. Done. That was about an hour 20. It's exactly hour 20. So we're snacking on some chicken, avocado, white rice. We have what? What is it? I'm gonna go down a little bit. By the way, ignore my laundry in the background. I gotta fold that still. You can see it. <laughs> I can. So we have what? Oh, what? Look at the snow. Oh, wait. You know what? It was supposed to just, just, just snow today. Anyways, so 200, you know, 175 grams of white rice. Chicken is seven ounces. And then a little bit of avocado sprinkle, sprinkle in there. So you don't see there. By the way, too, I have come prepared. Coconut aminos is the best thing for chicken. I'll tell you why. It literally makes your chicken taste like teriyaki or a stir fry thing and the smells is so good too i i <laughs> i remember uh, smelling stir fry i'm like dude i want stir fry it's so badly right now and it looks like and it tastes like the chicken is better with coconut meals also i did put a little bit of uh, a little bit of side mayo because only reason why i'll tell you why i didn't put a lot but the reason why is because I ran out of sauces, so I need to go back and get more sauces. 
that's the, that's basically the only reason why. I like doing barbecue sauce and Dijon mustard and a little bit of mayo. That way it makes a little bit more of a trick fly sauce. Because you can make your homemade trick fly sauce and that's just a that's just a great way to enjoy your meals. But yeah man, we home homemade cooked rice and chicken avocado. We are gonna slay this away. We also meal prep two meals for work today. I gotta be there in about 45 minutes in this dang snow. This is what you get for living in the Midwest, by the way. The, the, the snow is just freaking stupid. Look good though. No worries, that's just, just a bit. But anyways, gonna eat this. I mean, yeah, that's gonna be the end though. If y'all did enjoy this video, make sure you subscribe to the channel if you want more. And fill out my application down below for coaching. If you're interested in achieving more of your fitness goals. Yeah. That's like I said, that's all I got. And I'll talk to you probably tomorrow. So, peace, folks. You'll see us. Once again, bye, bro. Peace.